welcome to our training Create Product Variations Using the Add a Product Tool. If you'd like to list products in the Amazon store that are similar in nature but differ from each other by one or more factors like color and size, or color size and length, you don't have to list each one separately. Instead, you can create a variation family. When your product has variations, it has a parent ASIN and one or more child ASINs or variations. For example, if you sell a shirt in different sizes and colors, the shirt represents the parent ASIN. The shirt's variations, such as blue and medium, represent child ASINs. These variations are linked to a single product detail page in the Amazon store. Customers won't be able to see or purchase a parent ASIN, and its sole purpose is to hold the variation family together. In other words, the parent item isn't a physical product. You can either add a variation family and each of its variations when you create a new product listing, or you can add them to an existing listing. Let's first take a look at how you can add a variation family when you're creating a new product listing. To access the Variation Adding tool, select the menu icon in the top left corner of Seller Central. Hover over Catalog and select Add Products. Then, click I'm adding a product not sold on Amazon. After you find and select the category that best describes your product, you'll create your listing. Click through each tab and complete all required sections. You can also select the More Attributes toggle to reveal additional tabs and fields, which are optional but allow you to provide additional details about your product. When you're ready to create a variation family and add child ASINs to it, select the Variations tab and choose the variation type. This represents the factor that differentiates each of your products, like color. The field that appears will depend on your selection. For example, if you select color as your product's variation type, you'll enter each color you sell for the same product. Then, click Add. You can repeat this step for each product you'd like to create within this specific variation family. You can select additional variation types if the products differ from each other by more factors like size and length. Update each child ASIN with your offer information. This includes the seller SKU, product ID, condition, price, and quantity. Note that no two child ASINs can have identical offer information. Required fields for each item are marked with an asterisk and highlighted with red borders. The product information you fill out in the form's other sections will be copied across each child ASIN, but you can make changes to each child listing individually once you create the variation family. Once you add each child ASIN, you'll need to add images by editing each child ASIN individually. Once you're done adding your child ASINs and completing the required sections for your product listing, select Save and Finish. If no variation types are listed, you can create product variations because they are either not applicable to or not permitted in the product category you selected. You can view the parent ASIN on the Manage Inventory page. To get there, select the menu icon in the top left corner of Seller Central, hover over Inventory, and select Manage Inventory. If a product has a variation, you'll see variations in the status column. We'll also show the number of variations for the SKU in parentheses. Note that the parent ASIN isn't a physical item for sale. If you dissociate a parent item from its child items, the child items will become their own standard listings. Select the Variations drop-down menu to review each child ASIN. In this example, a seller hasn't added an image for each of a product's child items, which is causing them to be suppressed from Amazon Store search results. They can select Edit next to a child ASIN and then click Images to add them. The seller can also edit or add to other sections before selecting Save and Finish. If you need to add more items to the same variation family, select Edit next to the parent ASIN. Then click Variations and complete the required information as you did when you first set up the variation family. You can also use the bottom of the page to apply changes to an existing child ASIN or remove it from this parent product. 
remember to click Save and Finish before navigating away from the page. To add variations to an existing listing, return to the Product Adding page and type your product's name or identifier into the search box. We recommend using a product identifier such as a UPC, EAN, GTIN, or ISBN for the most accurate results. You can use the options under the Narrow by Category section to help narrow down your search results. If the product you searched for is part of a variation family, you'll see a Show Variations drop-down menu. Select it, choose the product you'd like to sell from the list, and follow the next steps that appear. If Not Available appears next to your product, select the Show Limitations drop-down menu to review the reason, and click Learn More for further details. If you see an Apply to Sell button next to a product, it's either a restricted product or requires approval before you can sell it in the Amazon store. Select the button to open a selling application, which you'll use to apply to get approval to list the product. Select the menu icon in the top left corner of Seller Central, hover over Catalog, and click View Selling Applications. Once approved, you can list the product variation in the condition you chose. Once you've found and selected your product's variation, enter the offer information into the offer section. We've marked all required fields with an asterisk symbol. You can select the More Attributes toggle to view and complete more optional fields, but you'll also be able to add them to your listing once you've created it. When you've completed the required fields as well as any optional fields, select Save and Finish to create your offer. This concludes our training on how to create product variations using the Add a Product tool. Thank you and happy selling in the Amazon store!